What is going on everyone? I'm Nux Pro and welcome to this Escape from Tarkov video. This video is going to be your complete guide for the two new weapons in the game, the Chiapa Rhino 357 Magnum and the Chiapa Rhino 9 mil. We're going to go over ammo. We're going to go over the limited modding and we're just going to go over some functionality. So let's get right into it, mother. Before we get started, don't forget to subscribe. We're almost at 14,300 subscribers, and I would love to quit my full-time job and do this. So please subscribe. And don't forget to check out the timestamps below if you want to move to a specific part of the video. Now, let's get into the Chiapa Rhino 357 Magnum. Now, there's two versions you can buy. First one is your basic model. We get that from our boy Jaeger. And you can get that at 14,000 rubles. And then there is the tactical version sold by Skier, which is 36,000 rubles, which is locked for some reason right now. But um, so the main difference between these is your basic one is just it's basic. <laughs> um, your tactical one comes with um, some fancy iron sights. So you see your front sights red your uh, rear sights green and you could even you know swap them out um, and the pistol grip is different the pistol grip on the tactical version gives you two plus ergo so you see I can't see the camera but it's 80 with the wooden grip and then it is 82 with the plastic grip and if you buy the tactical you get a, a pre-installed flashlight so no real difference unless you really care about the two ergo. Now let's get into the ammo. 357 is a brand new ammo to the game. There are four different types. There's the FMJ, the hollow point, the JHP, and the soft point. Now this was taken from the Tarkov wiki uh, the day after the weapon came out. So this could change, but this is what it is on release day. And on paper, it looks like the FMJ would probably be your best bet has the most penetration power but the stats are pretty interesting even though the pen is lower on some of these other rounds uh there's a higher flush damage you get some bonuses here you get some accuracy bonuses the fmj you get a little recoil penalty there's some fragmentation there's light bleed chance heavy bleed chance percentages that are higher on the the whatever lower looked upon rounds so again this is what it is on paper now what will actually work the best in practice remains to be seen these rounds are brand new right now looking like fmj is king especially at this point of the wipe with everybody wearing armor good armor i should say now let's talk about the chia papa rhino <laughs> nine mil you get this from jaeger uh for eight thousand rubles now this thing's pretty much the same thing as the 357 Magnum, but it's smaller and it shoots nine mil. So your PVP, your 6.3, your PST, your rip rounds. Also, you should note it only takes up one slot, unlike the 357, which is like every other pistol and takes up two slots. And in terms of modding, there's really not much you can do here. Um, they did say that there's going to be a speed loader added to the game in the future, but, um, all you can really do is you can change the grip to the plastic pistol grip gives you two ergo takes you from 96 to 98, um, ergo. So it doesn't really matter. And you can change your front iron sight to the red sight, which makes no effect on the weapon stats at all. Here is the Chiapa 357 Magnum. This is the tactical version with a laser. This is what it looks like when he checks mag. And this is what it looks like when he reloads. Or in this case, loads. So you can shoot this two different ways. There's single action. This is the gun, the way the gun usually comes in single action. And then there's double action. You change it by hitting whatever key you have the switch firing modes. 
So single action is going to be more of your long range shooting. As you can see, every single time he has to pull back. But you are relatively accurate. I was getting a little better groupings uh, before, um, but you know, not horrible, not great, but more accurate than double action, which I will show you now. So let's reload. All right, double action. There we go. As you can see, he did not pull back the lever so we could shoot faster. And that's actually more accurate than I've seen. But, uh, you know, definitely more of your close quartered attack. Because if you shoot from really far away with double action, shoot from like here. Yeah, you're all over the place. Whereas let's shoot single action from back here. You are a little more accurate. So when you reload, something to note, I don't know if this is a bug or it's fixed by now, but as you can see, I canceled the reload. So we only have uh, three rounds in. Um, earlier when the gun came out, you weren't able to cancel reload. So he goes through the whole animation and you're kind of just stuck. So I don't know if they fixed it. I don't know if it's only working because I'm in offline mode, but you weren't able to cancel the reload. So um, if you're finding that issue, um, you know, it's happened to me too. So I'm sure it's a bug if um, I'm canceling the reload now. And one other note when uh, reloading. So there's two other ways you can reload. So. You can reload normally, or you can just drag them in like that. He's still going to pull out all the rounds you use, even though you only dragged in one bullet. And then if you do your emergency reload, he will dump everything out, whether it's used or not. And he'll put everything back in. And then you're ready to go. Now let's look at our nine mil. The nine mil is pretty trash. <laughs> um, just imagine like shooting a Glock with your nine mil, but not being able to shoot fast and shooting an accurate. That's pretty much what this is. So here is your nine mil version, little guy, like the cricket for men in black. Let's reload it. We're using some PBP. Just like the 357, you have single and double. So single action. And I am shooting as fast as I can. Not very accurate. Let's reload it. Let's go to double action. Definitely seems like it shoots faster than 357, but holy crap, you are pretty inaccurate. So that is pretty much the nine mil. It is pretty much the same thing as the 357. Just looks different and shoots a different uh, ammo. You can see that the emergency reload is the same. He dumps the whole thing. 
He puts the rounds back in. But I hope you learned something from this video. Uh, pretty basic stuff. There's really not much going on with these weapons. Um, you know, in terms of how viable they are, they don't stack up against the the best pistols in the game, like the 5.7, the Glock, the USP. So they're more of a meme gun, but they, they look cool. They sound cool. And, um, you know, I definitely appreciate the effort that Battlestate puts into um, making these weapons realistic as possible. So uh, don't forget to subscribe. Again, almost at 14,300 subscribers. And we'll see you in the next video.